I'm Rachel Moore, and right now on your 13 Action News update, a Nevada judge has ruled the medical records of the girlfriend of former Las Vegas Raiders wide receiver Henry Ruggs can be accessed by prosecutors. Ruggs was speeding more than 150 miles per hour last November when he hit another car, killing 23-year-old Tina Tintor. Now, his girlfriend, who was the passenger in his car, was also injured. A preliminary hearing of evidence has been rescheduled for June 16th. And before you head out this weekend, take a look at this map. Starting this weekend, the 15 South will be closed from MLK to Las Vegas Boulevard. They're working on the pavement over there. Now pay attention to the red on this map because it shows you all the closures that are in effect from Sunday at 2 a.m. until Monday at 5 a.m. And the Lovers and Friends Music Festival will be taking over the Las Vegas Festival Grounds. That's located near Las Vegas Boulevard in Sahara. The event will feature hip hop and R&B legends like Lauryn Hill, Usher and TLC. It kicks off today and wraps up on Sunday. Doors open at 11 o'clock this morning. Kelsey. Well, it is going to be a really hot one. So whether you're heading to the Lovers and Friends Festival or maybe going to Las Vegas Days Parade, You'll want to keep the water and sunscreen handy. Light and loose clothing is key because we are jumping up more than 10 degrees above average in the mid to upper 90s today. 100 degrees by Sunday and we're staying in the upper 90s through the rest of the week with the return of breezy conditions Sunday through Friday. Kelsey, thank you. And that was your 13 Action News update. You can find more on our website at KTNB.com and our free mobile app.